Yo, we got a season nine master on our team. This Galio player who locked in Zed. See if he gets us a free win. But anyway, I'm Uncle Loco. I'm a Diamond Cannon one trick. I'm playing against Poppy. I took Conqueror. I took Ultimate Hunter because I'm testing it out. Uh, Ravenous Hunter nerfs kind of hit pretty hard. So the rune's pretty dead for now. I played like three games with it, and it healed me 280 in a 20 minute game with three stacks. So I'm just going to try out ultimate and relentless hunter if I'm mid lane. I queued mid lane, but I got jungle, and then this guy swapped for me, so I'm happy. Whew. Yeah, Kenna versus Poppy, it's a pretty easy matchup. I think it's one of Poppy's least favorite matchups, just because she can't really fight back. All she can do is like all in you, but you just run away. I'm walking near this Mork here, so if she does get a proc, she gets 20 gold. Because the Spell Thief's Edge uh, passive, she need a ally champion near you to get the gold. So that's why I'm like hovering here with her. So now she walks in the lane with 20 free gold. Right, I did take Cole because this is a farm lane. You're not really going to kill her unless she makes mistakes. So I think Cole is the best option here. You can go Doran's Blade if you want. I wouldn't recommend any AP items since you want your auto attacks to be dealing damage early. That's your main source of damage, like levels 1 through 4. And that's when you're the strongest against Poppy right now. I am going to slow shove. Take a million minion aggro damage. Because I wasn't paying attention. Take every auto you can get against Poppy. Because that's where your damage comes from. This is a pretty standard concept against most melee top laners. You take all the damage you can get whenever you can get it. Alright, I can't proc my Conqueror anymore. Kindred's bot side, so I'm pretty fine here to just keep doing what I'm doing. She took biscuits, bro. How annoying. You wish I didn't have a stun ready? Dude, I'm missing so much CS. Nice. Uh, I did not know they were fighting. Please give me this red buff. I didn't get the red buff, but I got an assist. Plus 110. Dude, imagine Klepto used to give us plus 110 gold sometimes. That rune was... Busted. Do not waste Q. Muted. Bro, players just are not nice. Nice. I got all the damage I could there. Kindred's dead. She will be topside, though. So I'm going to shove this. Stop this recall. Shove this. Kindred's going to be here as soon as possible. So I want this wave in her tower. Because Kindred is topside now. She has to be because she cleared all of her bot camps, died here, and then she's around here. So you might meet her here. We'll see. If I was her, I'd be on these two camps right here. I'm going to go... Boots. This and refillable, actually. I'm just going to walk to lane. She didn't recall with me, so I'm actually kind of okay to just walk. I'm going to save TP for bot lane since they're tilting. This guy's name is Poop. It's literally just Poop. I didn't even see that. Nice. So now all I have to do is not let her shove this next wave in. And then she's out of the game. Because if she can't do that, uh, she can't recall here. And all she wants to do is recall. Cure.
Don't let her flash. Get her! Mastery has 355 base movement speed, by the way. I think it's just 350. No, it's 355. Yeah. Insane, bro. Uh, I am going to be maxing Q since she is playing a little bit too aggressive, and I can punish her for that. Or she's playing not safe, not even aggressive. She's just not playing safe. I'm going to... She teleported. Kindred's bot side, so I am fine gaming right now. Let's just mute them. No, I missed! Now she can just ult me. Don't ult me! What? What was that, bro? Okay, we're getting shutdowns. She can't freeze this, right? Uh, I'll just TP. Now we're just starting to dive here. Because she greedily stayed. Alright, cool. I'm gonna let this shove into me here, actually. Just deny her the CS that I can. Place that there, just in case Kendry comes creeping up. Walk over here. If she walks up here, I just cure. If not, I just order this. She wishes she could deny that from me. I misplayed that actually. If I just press R whenever she ease me there, she dies. But now I have to recall because I made that mistake. She can't freeze it since she does have Bombie Cinder, so I'm fine to just recall here. Maybe, actually, we can make a play with E. Their flashes match timers. And this is control worded. Gonna take a base here. I'm fine. I wish you didn't recall. Now I'm in the prime position for them to dive me, but Kinder's not here, so we're fine. As long as Echo doesn't leave lane, then I'm fine to stay. Though I am very uncomfortable right now. Because she can just eat me under tower and then I die. Which is she's trying to do right now. be careful using abilities because she can just dive me. Echo's missing. I'd rather not die to this. Yeah. The way she's moving there, like, I can afford to just give up 3 CS. I'd rather not have to die there. Yep, that dive was definitely coming. That was good awareness by me. Very good awareness. Sad that you had to lose Scuttle there, but it's not the end of the world. Do it, Zed. Ah, uh, nice try. 
How did she get over here? I guess she just walked through like this path here. Cause it's not worded. Why are they pinging each other, man? Just lose gracefully. Just gonna deny her what I can here. The poppy. Uh, got that. And since my support and jungler are up topside, uh, I can just zone her for a bit. I don't know what my support's doing. I think they're trolling each other. But then maybe it works out. We'll see. Did she recall? She did not recall. You're so mad. That's why we max Q. If we max W there, we don't have enough damage. I'm gonna let this wave reset here. Uh, never mind. He's gonna use Rift Herald. Why are they flaming each other, man? Chill. I'm reading their things. I don't know what's happening here, but like, man, they're not happy game. Can I get this? I cannot get this. I lost a cannon. Dude, what is more doing? It actually is kind of troll what she's doing. Uh, I need to go search choose this game because I need damage. Ionians are best if you're up against like tanks or like. Stuff like Tristana Alistar, where you just get blown away in team fights. So I guess Phase Rush is even better for that too. Uh, rather than just Ionians. The reason I'm walking mid here is because I have teleport for top lane when I need if I need to go up there, and I have ult and I can change the fight down here. I can turn a fight here at this Drake. Where'd they all go? That was a sick kill. Bro, don't be afraid. There we go, ye. There we go, ye. Good stuff, brother. This ye and I will carry. I'm gonna walk up to this mark here, actually. I can't die to Echo, so I can just E forward here aggressively. Hi Echo. I'm going top lane. Tristan is dead. Very good trade, Tristana. So Kindred is going to path up here. I'm just going to go. I can't really do much here, can I? Thanks for the scuttle, bro. I don't think this is a good idea, but there's no other play that they're gonna make. Yeah, there's Karma here too. So if I don't walk down here, we might actually lose it. They just double flashed me, bro. That's so cringe. I hate that. Worst feeling. Double flash. Actually, just the worst feeling in the game. Ever. Thanks for the mark, bro. So, Karma and Echo Flash match mine. I will be the bot laner now. Maybe you can help me. Tristana, please don't walk down here. Just go mid. I can't walk top lane, because I just die. She's gonna just grief split, isn't she? Alright. That's fine. Poppy decided to shove the wave, which means I can go up there now. I'm going to go void staff this game. So, I'll just get this and this and walk top. I want sort of choose as soon as I can. I haven't got a CS in like, two minutes, bro. Luckily, Poppy shoved the wave for me, though. What a nice gal. 
I've been kind of perma-fighting this game, so my CS is pretty low, but that's usually fine. If you're getting stuff. Uh, yes! Yeah, uh, your CS doesn't have to be more than like 6 or 7 per minute. I would recommend for it not to go below 6. Because I think at that point you're just losing a lot of CS in side lane somewhere. on a dead again. I can't help this, can I? I'm gonna have to try. Do I just get poppied here? What? Bro. I suck. I didn't get anything there. I guess they got the other guy. Not the end of the world. We got a tower. And I, like, stopped them, but... Now I lose this cannon wave. That's what I hate about teleporting down here when I'm freezing. I needed to shove this first and then do it. A uh, little mistake by me, but it's not awful. It's just tragic. There's so many pings this game, man. Alright, Echo can't kill me. Likely. And he will die to this Zed if he walks up here. I think we win 2v2 against Kindred and Echo. I'm just trying to finish my coal out so I can get Void Staff soon. That's fine. That Rift doesn't give them anything. It just gives them, like, morality. Or morale, not morality. Uh... Because, like, what are they going to get with it, bro? They're probably going to drop it mid some point and get nothing. And then say, good rift, good rift. Because that's what I'd do if I were them. Auto attack the kindred. You skew here? You skew? Yay. I didn't get her. She just dashed away, bro. I'm dead. I'm not dead! He's gonna flash on us. Alright, we're fine. Dude, I'm getting nothing with these roams. And I'm kinda sad. I think we have to concede this dragon. We can't really fight it. He messed up his Q there. If he did it right, he could've got both of them. He just didn't Q when he needed to. And then he died. If he Qs as the Kindred R is like, going down, then he can get them both. And not die. It was just like a slight mechanical error. I missed that. Brother. What are we dying to, man? Well, that sucks. Dude, my bot lane's 12 deaths. They're 12 out of our 17 deaths. That's really high. Since they just monkeyed mid lane, I am safe to shove this wave in. I will get this and this. I'll walk bot. They lose this wave. Or at least some of it. They lost like four minions. Not too bad. Yeah, gonna walk bot. I'll have teleport up in time for Baron if they decide to rush it. I won't, but they shouldn't. They do have a lot of damage for it, though. I'm gonna look to shove this wave and the next wave, and then walk up to Baron. Or just mid lane. We'll see. Actually, can I just freeze this? I think the minion RNG worked out in my favor, so I can freeze. So I will. I love freezing. Well, they're dying again. I look away for like half a second and they're dead. And my Zed's spam pinging them off cooldown. So I think what I have to do is shove this because they're going to come kill me. Never mind, they stopped, but they had Rift. 
Are they going to do the thing that I said? Where they take nothing and then say, good rift, good rift? We'll see. I can't flash into them here because Kindred has ultimate. So I think we give in Hib and then the enemy goes to Baron and then we're sad. Because I also have Bane Condemn. If I try anything. Never mind, she was slow. I saw her at low HP and that I could stun her out of it. So I did. Let's go, team! Let's go, team! Cringe. What? We can go. Yeah, I saw Kindred with a stack on her, and I knew I could one-shot her in time. Even through the Karma Shield, I killed her. Good try, Echo. Good try. We have enough damage for Baron. Uh, I got the cannon. I'm happy. I don't have any damage for Baron, so I'm gonna not go to it. I'm just gonna recall. Then I'm gonna get a stopwatch. And I'm gonna walk bot lane. Actually, I think I should walk mid lane. I think my team's gonna run it if I don't group with them. Dude, I have 5 KP. My Tristana has 3 though, so I'm doing better than her. My wolves. Zed will be the split pusher instead of the cannon with teleport, but that's fine. Zed's probably even more safe than I am. Can I have this? I can. Thank you, Tristana. Yeah, dude, he's just OP. Uh, we don't really care about this Echo. We really don't. They can have that tower if they want, bro. I have to be careful though. If Vayne just walks up somewhere and condemns me into the tower or into a wall, I die instantly. So I still have to be careful. I don't know what the rest of my team is doing. But we'll hope that it's something good. Like, I know Karma is sitting behind this kindred, so that's why I'm not going in on her. Or else she wouldn't be this far up, actively trying to get a kill. Yeah. I would rather not teleport to that tower, and I'd rather be here, Mr. Zed. Like, bro, look at this gamer. Cringe! Bro, that was so annoying. You saw me, like, protobelt here, then get instantly jerked back. Yeah, so I don't really care what happens to that tower, because they don't get anything off it other than, like, 50 global gold for each of their champions and a bit on Echo. I'd rather win the Drake fight than go stop Echo. And then lose the Drake fight, because that's how we lose the game. We don't lose the game if we lose that tower, which is why that's what I did. No, more got it again. So actually, that was worth it. Tristana can't freeze though, so that sucks. I'm gonna walk down here, just in case Zed gets- yeah. I was gonna say, just in case Zed gets like 4 manned. But he's dead. Right? Sure that he just dies. Yeah. We knew they were down there, but I guess he had to go for a kill. Or wanted to go for a kill. I'm only really afraid of Vayne this game. I think most players in this game would agree with that. Hi, Kindred. You're mad! So Vayne's still bot lane. Echo's the only one who's alive that can kill me. And I can really... No, he's not. He's down there. Uh, we'll be fine. I don't think if I recall that I do anything, so I'm staying here. Later, Poppy. I'm gonna walk up here, because if I walk through here and we face check them, then I die. 
I'm gonna see what I can get. Maybe Scuttle. Yeah, I'll go get Scuttle. Hey Poppy, please don't see me. Thank you. Do I have enough for Zonia? I do. I have exactly enough. So I'm gonna recall. I'll walk top. Zed's gonna die. No big deal. I don't have all. They still win because we're gaming? I'm gonna have to dodge that. I had to dodge it. I had to dodge that. Uh, Morg shouldn't ping me. Because if I get ulted out, we can't win that. Unless Poppy can, but I don't think she can. Hi, Echo. I don't trust this Trisana to do anything. Don't trust her as far as I can throw her. Which honestly, both are... I won't say. W towards this, bro. You wish you killed me. Now at this point, I just want to team fight with Master Yi. I want to recall, sell my refillable, and get a elixir. Because this Baron fight will probably decide the game. I do want level 16 before it though, and I don't think that's possible. So that sucks. Getting level 16 gives you so much damage on your ultimate man. I say so much, but it's like 35 damage per tick. It's just a lot more than than level 15. Why don't we just go to Baron instead of fighting this in a weird way? Like, what, man? Actually, just what? I didn't even use my elixir there, bro. I didn't even use my elixir and I didn't level up my ultimate, but we won anyway. Dude, I'm honoring this Zed. He like single-handedly allowed us to win the game, uh, mid-game. Love Galio. I love Galio. Good shot calling. My bot lane did not deserve that win. Plus 20. Can I click this? Or is my game bugged? I'm getting a scroll. I'm getting the spinny mouse of death. My damage probably isn't as high as Zed's or Master Yi's, but we'll see. <sighs> wow, Master Yi did the least damage on our team. Never mind then. <sighs> I think it's top diff. <laughs> so yeah, that's Cannon vs. Poppy. I think it's a pretty easy matchup, no matter the jungle matchup. Uh, Yeah, take Conqueror. Auto her to death. You'll be fine. <laughs> see you later.